Vulcan Materials Company. Let's go! Representation matters. The game is over. Good morning, it is a good day to have a good day. Welcome to another vlog, everyone. It is a cold Sunday morning here. I think it's, what is it, January 9th? 8th? January 8th, and it's like barely 8 a.m. It's like 7.40 right now, but I woke up early because Daniel is taking me to my first Bears game. I'm so excited, y'all. Oh, this has been on like my bucket list of things to do. As y'all know, I love the Bears. I have a bunch of Bears gear on right now, but it's cold. We're waiting for the train right now, but I'll show y'all the full fit. Anyways, we got to make our way downtown to have some brunch, and then we're going to make it to the game. It's a 12 o'clock game on this Sunday, so we'll see, but I'm really hoping they win because, you know, it's my first game, but the season's been rough like rough so anyways just want to intro the vlog i'm so excited i'm so pumped but yeah go bears bear down i hope they win please okay we're going to brunch but i need a little snack on the train we're on the train now but we set that fire cake last night and i got a nice jelly donut here all right we just got done with brunch we are stuffed i was supposed to be on a detox but the waitress already gave me a mimosa so i participated anyways we just went through we just got through this cab ride where we were all stuffed in the back and we made it though so we're all walking look at this crowd go bears but we're walking to Soldier Field now. I'm so excited. Let's go. Woo! Up. Okay. Here's Soldier Field, y'all. We made it. Vulcan Materials Company. Thank you for your support as Chicago.
too. Maybe after halftime they do. I'll They lost. It was 29, 26, 29 to 13, but not too bad. We didn't. We scored something at least. But last game of the season, no playoffs for us. But honestly, really good first experience. The weather actually held out. It was nice. The sun came out for a little bit, but yeah, couldn't get. Are you? <laughs> no. <laughs> couldn't get that Bears dub. But honestly, we'll see it. We'll get them next season. Anyways, I did get nachos. <laughs> I didn't get nachos and this nice souvenir bowl thing and I washed it in the bathroom. Okay, hi, update. We have finally... What is that? For me? Yeah. Oh my gosh. We're home now. Daniel just gave me a Christmas present. Is that a new mug? I don't know. Oh my god. Do you want me to open it on camera? Sure. Okay, sorry, this is not what I was gonna update y'all, but we're home and Daniel just gave me a Christmas present. Okay, well, unboxing. I don't know if it's a picture of me. Oh, that's so nice! Daniel's infamous mug, okay. Oh, you're never too old to be young. <laughs> <laughs> Classic. Daniel is. This is his gift every year, is a mug of him. Oop, out of focus. Yeah, and place I'm... your orders now if you want one. Yeah, hold on, let's focus. There, here we go. Daniel's mug, wow, how handsome. Leak in the bio, place With your orders. Fireworks. <laughs> yeah, my favorite. <laughs> yeah. Anyways, thank you. Yeah. Anyways, as y'all can see, we're home. Oh, I'm exhausted, I've been up. I woke up at like 6 a.m. this morning. It's the cold. It really drains you. But anyways, I'm going to change and then head home. But I forgot to give you all an OTD, my game day fit. Anyways, first thing, this hat. Got myself it for Christmas. It's from 47, which you all know I love 47 brand. Um, just this nice pom-pom bear's hat. And then rocking my winter Columbia coat because it was... 30 degrees today in Chicago and this is I've had this go forever, but it's long it keeps me warm Underneath we've got this vintage Bears crew neck. Oh my gosh. I love this sweater If y'all saw my vlog where I went to the Illinois vintage fest This is where I got this sweater from I finally got to wear it out to a game and then underneath I'm just rocking a white turtleneck as usual because yeah, it was cold I was wearing this t-shirt I got from Abercrombie underneath, but I had to put on the layers. And then I have fleece leggings and some socks, some bear socks. And I was wearing boots, but I had to take those off. But anyways, that's the update. Just want to show y'all the OOTD. Okay, hi, update. Um, I'm editing this video. And I realized I did not film an outro. It's like Wednesday night now. Uh, but yeah, Sunday. Sunday was a great day to have a great day, honestly. As y'all saw, I went to my very first NFL game, the Chicago Bears game. First time watching them. First time watching them at Soldier Field. Oh my gosh, it was such a good time. I have to shout out Daniel. Thank you so much, Daniel, if you're watching this. TQM. Oh my gosh. So Daniel actually gifted me this Bears game as my Christmas gift and he told me actually a couple months before Christmas just so I could be prepared and like do any shopping I needed to do and literally when he told me I, I could not believe it like I was like no like we're not going and then like as the days kept going on I was like wait we're going he's like yeah like I had the tickets all squared away and stuff and it actually ended up working out because um two of our friends Briar and Fallon they're actually married but they're friends from Rose Holman 
and Briar is a huge Vikings fan so Daniel was talking to them and suggested that we watch the game the four of us together here in Chicago at Soldier Field because the Vikings were playing the Bears so I was like oh it just ended up working out so anyways shout out again to Daniel thank you so much I honestly had a blast y'all like it was such a good day it ended up being like 30 degrees which might sound cold for y'all but around here that it was a warm it was a warmer day that it's been because it's been like minus 10 degrees minus like the windshield has been like minus 30 degrees like it's been cold like the last two bears game were like freezing temperatures and people still went so like i was getting nervous i was like oh my gosh there's no way anyways it ended up being so nice out the sun even came out barely any wind it was like a 12 o'clock game so it was still bright out and i only had to wear a couple layers and like i felt comfortable so that ended up being great i realized the clips that i got were just like random little snippets here and there but honestly i was just so invested in the game and the experience like i love the chicago bears like i love football like i don't know if y'all know that i'm literally i'm wearing bears a bear shirt right now like that's how much i love the chicago bears but yeah fun fact i love watching football i love actually watching a lot of live sports like baseball games they're boring on tv if i'm gonna be honest but they're fun to watch i still have yet to watch hockey live and the bulls play live and yeah up until this point i had not ever seen an nfl game so i was like super stoked as y'all saw i get super into the game i yell at the players as if i'm their coach this was just something i've always wanted to check off my bucket list thank you again to daniel for letting me experience this but yeah honestly 12 out of 10 experience would do it again maybe in a warmer month if i'm being honest because because afterwards it was brutal it was brutal on the walk back to the train but maybe in the earlier parts of this the football season i'll go catch a game but now i know how to do it now i've been there before i could be a pro at it i know what soldier feels like so yeah this is the first of hopefully many bears games i'll be going to from now on because it was so fun the vibes so good so anyways yes i just want to share with y'all my first time watching the chicago bears because it was a momentous moment in my life if i'm being honest so anyways with that said thank you so much for watching if you want to follow me on instagram it's ariel's a-i-r-y-e-l-s and as always be safe stay healthy and be kind thanks y'all